What's up YouTube? It's the Big Kahuna back again with another video. And I'd like to give a shout out to Pure Apex Skills and Gary Hutchin. And on to today's video. So a bunch of YouTubers and I put together a Facebook group called The Live Squad. Now if you want to check us out, please come over and you know join up with the live squad. Um the live squad is about getting the gamers together so we can talk about gaming and do things that we like gaming so uh we sometimes uh like kids smooth he will host an event where you know the gamers come together in a tournament whether it be racing games or shooting games or fighting games or whatever but um that's what this uh group is all about gaming so when i say and it's for the gamers so when i say for the gamers for the gamers means anybody who has a ps4 x1 pc wii u handhelds whatever this is what gaming is all about so we're gamers so i'ma just I'm going to start saying a couple things that some people may not like. And if you don't like it, I really don't give a damn. Um, you could either take it or leave it. It doesn't make a difference. But um, so the other day, which I mean yesterday, my son calls me into his room. And he was watching a female play Outlast. Her name is O.I. Miss Lou. Shout out to you. So, this female was playing Outlast, and in the comment section, as usual, there was people calling her sluts, whores, bitches, and stuff like that. In the live squad, this is unacceptable. Um, I was a, I'm a part of uh, XB1 United, which we know is not the, called XB1. I'm on the XB1, so I can't really say. But um, anyway, you get what I'm saying. But... Uh, so some female posted in that group something about fanboys i can't remember exactly what it was and then the first comment was shut up you gutter slut this shit is unacceptable when i say gamers i mean gamers so if you happen to play only an hour a day or hardly ever or all the time but you have a gaming system you're an, you're a gamer and I don't care what your sexual preference is. I don't care what your re religious background is. I don't care what your ethnic background is or your nationality is. We all game together. So I don't want to hear or we don't want to hear any hate speech to any of these people. Whether it be somebody who come in and say he's homosexual or lesbian or whatever. We don't want to hear none of that stuff or see none of that stuff. So now that we got that down, if you do not like that and you are in the group, you can leave. If you haven't come to the group yet and you don't like what I'm saying, don't bother. But on to some gaming news. So it, it's come to my attention that Halo 2 is most likely probably not going to be in 1080p. And once again, it's something that people are harping on. Oh, it... it you guys are delusional uh um what are y'all gonna damage control now this is not damage control so i'm gonna read something from game informer which i got yesterday um it's talking about the amazing spider-man 2 which was given a 5.5 so you know they always have their categories concept graphic sound playability entertainment and replay value so i'm gonna get right to the graphics Okay, because this is what the people associate, uh, you know, the resolution with graphics. So here it goes. It says, the PlayStation 4 and the X1 versions look qu only marginally better than last gen. Marginally be better at native 1080p. So, as I've said before, people need to get off the whole 1080p thing. I mean, it's native 1080p and only looks marginally better than last gen. So, I play games, not resolutions. So, as I always said, fanboys don't like their favorite system. They just hate yours. Peace.